Wonder leads to gratitude. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Kayla Ochoa. The hummingbird gets its English name from the hum made by its rapidly beating wings. In other languages, such as Portuguese, it is known as the flower kisser, or in Spanish, flying jewels. One of my favorite names for this bird is Bayulu, which is Mexican Zapotec for what remains in the eye. In other words, once you see a hummingbird, you'll never forget it. G.K. Chesterton wrote, The world will never starve for want of wonders, but only for want of wonder. The hummingbird is one of those wonders. What is so fascinating about these tiny creatures? Well, maybe it's their small size, averaging two to three inches, or the speed of their wings that can flap from 50 to 200 times per second. We aren't sure who wrote Psalm 104, but the psalmist was certainly captivated by nature's beauty. After describing many of creation's wonders, like the cedars of Lebanon and the wild donkeys, he sings, May the Lord rejoice in his works. Then he prays, May my meditation be pleasing to him. Nature has plenty of things that can remain in the eye because of their beauty and perfection. How can we meditate on them and please God? We can observe, rejoice, and thank God as we contemplate His works and recapture the wonder. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Psalm 104, verses 24 through 35. How many are your works, Lord! In wisdom you made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. There is the sea, vast and spacious, teeming with creatures beyond number, living things both large and small. There the ships go to and fro, and Leviathan, which you form to frolic there. All creatures look to you to give them their food at the proper time. When you give it to them, they gather it up. When you open your hand, they are satisfied with good things. When you hide your face, they are terrified. When you take away their breath, they die and return to the dust. When you send your spirit, they are created, and you renew the face of the ground. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. May the Lord rejoice in his works. He who looks at the earth and it trembles, who touches the mountains and they smoke. I will sing to the Lord all my life. I will sing praise to my God as long as I live. May my meditation be pleasing to him as I rejoice in the Lord. But may sinners vanish from the earth, and the wicked be no more. Praise the Lord, my soul. Praise the Lord. That's today's scripture reading, Psalm 104, verses 24 through 35. And now let's pray together. Dear Heavenly Father, help us to reflect on the wonders of nature, Lord, and meditate on them with thankfulness for all you have done for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.